Hagerberg Hospital has unveiled its new radiotherapy machines. Now, these machines are aimed at improving the outcomes for patient care, uh, patients. Sessions with the machine take just 15 to 30 minutes and can be done completely outpatient. The hospital sees over 2,200 new cancer patients a year. For more on this, we're joined by the hospital's head of radiation oncology, Henriette Berger. A uh, very good morning to you, Ms. Berger. Thank you for your time uh, this morning. Uh, really good news for, for cancer patients. But yes, you are unveiling your new machines. Um, but you actually have been using this type of therapy since May. And as of the 13th of, of November, we have numbers of about 81 people who have been treated. Uh, tell us about the results that they have um, that they have seen. Um, thank you, Tommy. So um, yes, yeah, so the machine that we are unveiling today is a high tech variant true beam machine, and it is uh, one of four machines that we use to deliver radiation therapy um, to our patients. Um, the process of installation has um, taken most of uh, this year, 2023, because it's such an advanced technical um, procedure. So the machine actually went live in August. Um, and yesterday was our official um, launch where we were joined by um, uh, leaders and uh, representatives from the Western Cape um, Department of Health and Wellness. Um, so this specific machine has advanced technology which um, reduces possible side effects due to radiotherapy and therefore makes it easier for patients to complete a course of radiation and recover um, after they've completed the course much faster. So you talk about reduced side effects. Typically, what are the side effects that patient cancer, uh, cancer patients would experience when undergoing uh, therapy and how and which ones are actually reduced by this new machine? Um, so radiotherapy side effects really depend on the area of the body where we are uh, in which the cancer is located. So you can imagine um, if you have um, a cancer in the um, mouth area, um, <clears throat> the radiotherapy will also damage tissues like your lips and your tongue. Um, it'll even cause um, dryness of the mouth. Um, so these are all the things that we try to reduce by shielding off the areas that are not um, directly affected by cancer. If you have cervical cancer, which is one of the most common cancers affecting women in South Africa, um, you are in a different area of the body where things like um, discomfort um, when going to the bathroom or abdominal cramps would probably be your relevant side effects. So it really depends on the area of the body that your cancer is located in. And, and so the, the Varian True Beam Linear Accelerator or, or LINAC, the, the machine, is able to treat all sorts of cancers, whether it's mouth cancer, prostate, head, neck, uh, neurological cancer, every type of cancer is, is able to be treated by LINAC. Exactly. Um, and not just every type of cancer, but also specialized techniques um, that we sometimes require to, to treat cancers. Um, what we are especially excited about is um, the ability of this machine to treat very small tumors um, and small tumors located in the brain um, and located in other organs. Um, so this is part of the um, capabilities of this machine that we will be trained on um, and that we will be um, commissioning in the near future. And, and what type of success rates are you expecting here? Will it be able to completely annihilate uh, the tumor? So I think it's important to understand that um, this machine uh, Will, won't have any different success rates than the machines that we are already using. Um, radiotherapy is an extremely effective treatment option for many types of cancers. Um, and this machine will just continue on that um, pattern of highly effective cancer control. Um, the focus is really um, on the, um, the relief of the side effects. 
Um, and yes, there will be certain types of cancer um, that we will now be able to treat um, in addition to what we usually um, did. But for most um, cases, um, the pattern of cancer control will continue to be excellent. And who qualifies for this type of, 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 um, of, of treatment? Do you have to be at a specific stage of, of, of diagnosis, for example? Uh, I wouldn't say that, um, Tommy. So our machine, uh, like I said, it's one of four machines and we utilize our four machines as effectively as possible. Um, so depending on the type of cancer that you have, and yes, the stage, um, the team of oncologists, radiotherapists, and medical physicists sit together with um, the surgical team to decide um, what type of radiotherapy would be best um, for you. So this is at the, the Tigerberg Hospital. Uh, where else are these machines likely to, to be made uh, available, the LINAC machines? Um, so I, I can't speak for where they are likely to be made available, but I know that um, in the Western Cape, we are very fortunate to also have a similar machine at Grittesgeer Hospital. Um, and then there's also one machine in, um, in a private oncology service available. Um, so I would really hope to see that um, this machine also becomes available to the greater South Africa um, and in other provinces. As far as um, accessibility, price, etc., is it, it is covered under medical aid, I assume. Um, but if one is not under m medical aid, is it going to be available and accessible to, to them too? Yeah, so I think that is the wonderful um, thing about this um, investment in advanced technology that the Western Cape Department of Health and Wellness has made um, because they have literally made the top line um, uh, advanced technology radiotherapy available to every patient that attends public health care in the Western Cape. Um, and in terms of um, cost, um, there is no difference um, in terms of a, a patient attending our care where oncology care is fully covered by the subsidized public health care system, which is amazing. It sounds like welcome relief, I, I tell you, uh, for those who are cancer patients and are needing just relief from the side effects of, of radiotherapy. Thank you so much for, for your time and wishing you continued success as, as you go out you know, healing and providing solutions to so many. Thank you.